Hi everyone, so I'm back to share another journal with you. Um, this one is Dragonfly Dreams and it's a kit from Artie Mays. Actually, it's a few of Artie Mays' kits. Um, love this kit, I haven't played with it for a while, so I thought I would um, have a little play today. Um, and it was only because I, when I was having a clear out, I found two pages, two full pages from the kit and I just thought, oh, I'm gonna, I'll just print out some more and do a journal. So the journal is uh, just slightly bigger than a traveller's notebook size, um, as in width wise. Let me just get my ruler. Okay, so it is, um, it is eight and a quarter height, but oh yeah, it is, it's exactly about four and a half wide. So um, I've got this topper on here, which is fabric. Um, corrugated card which has been gessoed the image is one of the journaling cards from the kit then i put on this lace um which is like a crochet crocheted lace there's two little um mother of pearl buttons on here and then this um button there and they've just got a little bit of wax linen thread running through them um that is the cardstock that i used <clears throat> Um, this will be listed on my shop if you're interested. We've got crocheted trim, bead dangles. I've done them blue because a lot of the journal is blue. Um, so let's go inside. I really enjoyed playing around with this. I've done a few little different things. Well, different for me. They're probably just they're out there anyway. Um, <clears throat> but I'll show you them as I go along. So we have that page. This is actually from the um, Dragonfly Specimen kit not actually the main kit but <clears throat> um there is the main kit in this as well so i've made my little corner pockets put some um, lace trim down the um just down the edge uh, i used some of the pages to make tags which is that is one of them this is a journal card from the kit and this is from the dragonfly specimen kit so that goes in there uh doily paper bag journal card in the paper bag that's actually been backed onto some cream paper it's like a heavyweight paper uh, this is the old design shop as is this uh, pocket which is from the kit um, this is from the specimen dragonfly specimen kit so is this i just put some of the little tickets on the pages we have the crochet trim and the bead dangle we have i think actually most of the decoration is towards the middle in this one a tag from the kit and this is the old design shop we have an envelope which has just got some paper it's doubled over and there's another envelope and it's got like exactly the same bit of paper well not the exact same bit of paper but a bit of paper very similar um so that goes in there this is artie Maisie's um eco dyed kit so you can find that on her shop in her shop as well right this um i think no i don't think i know <laughs> i've seen this from uh dawn who is the book vandal shop she'd done something similar with little kind of flips and pockets so i done this one um so i've got a tag in the back of there and I've made the page, I just shrunk it down a little bit, I think it was to like 90% and, and then just folded this bit in to make a side tuck and I've stenciled all around here and there's a lot of shimmer on this paper. We've got a postcard from Artie Maisie's Dragonfly kit and the tag there. So you've got the pocket and then you've got this pocket but that's also journal space and and um, that's journal space and you could if you wanted to cover that up with a photo but I personally wouldn't because it's a really nice image <laughs> uh, another little ticket <clears throat> lots of journal room another journal card another little ticket here's a top a top tuck <laughs> A uh, journal card from the kit, which has been backed onto a coffee dyed paper. This was just made out of that cream, um, like paper. It is, it's, it's actually got a watermark on the paper. It's good quality paper. So I just coffee dyed that, and then just you got a journal, double journal card, and stamped on there. So this is another. I showed. Well, I didn't show. I well, I did show in my video yesterday. This was an idea 
similar to Hermelinda's and uh, there was a lady that asked and I have, if you watch yesterday's video, you will see <clears throat> on the comments, I've linked to the video. Um, so this all opens out and I just done a little kind of like cluster thing here and that all folds out. I know you're not going to be able to see all that because I'm kind of off frame. The ones that I done yesterday, um, I had them coming that way and I stenciled on there. But today's one, I just folded that in like that. So you've got all that journal room and it all folds up into a pocket. So like I said, you could do it that way if you wanted to. But I've done it that way today. And the little paper clip holds everything in. We've got a tag from the kit, and this is actually opened at the top as well, so you can pop something in there. So this tag from the kit, <clears throat> uh, I made these two, well these two, that double little journal guard. You could split that up if you wanted to. Um, this is a journal card from the kit. It's just because one one dragonfly is that way and the other one's coming that way. I didn't know which way was up or down. <laughs> so anyway, uh, that goes in there. And then this is from the dragonfly specimen kit. And that's just in there. So then we have some more crocheted trim and a bead dangle. I've done another flippy floppy thing. <clears throat> Again, inspired by Dawn. Um, so I've folded that piece to make the pocket just glued it on there and there got my pocket here you've got all that if you want to cover it over you could journal on here stick a photo um and then you can write all inside there or if you wanted to you could kind of fold a bit over and make another pocket so that's that page up on the frame still center of the signature What's the journal room? Another one of these flippy floppy pockets. I'm not going to pull it all out, but you know, it's the same as the other one I've just shown. Uh, another tag from the kit that is opened at the back as well. If you wanted to put things inside there, um, another little double like journal card which has been stamped. Another journal card from Artie Maisie's kit, and then another little specimen card. And then on here, I just done another little cluster. So again, that is a lot of potential writing space. Another top tuck. We have a dragonfly journal card from the kit. That has just got some lace trim down there. Another double derby my flip. <clears throat> and again, another, that is, that's the page from the dragonfly specimen kit. <clears throat> so here's just a little flip. Another journal card inside there, and that's just held on with a paper clip. Paper bag, I had to go around and cut all my paper bags last night because if you watched yesterday's video, I had coffee dyed them all and I forgot to um, cut them. I normally do all that one, one hit. So here we have got another flippy floppy thing. Um, again, Dawn, an, an idea from Dawn, and this is a journal card. and. That has just been stenciled. And I don't know if the camera's picking it up, but it is very shimmery. A little ticket that I've just glued on here. Another pocket from the kit. A specimen card, tag, an envelope. This is the other side of the eco dyed papers from Artie Mays. And that's just got paper in it, like I said. <clears throat> there we go. Oh, and that's just a journal card from the kit. Little flip, uh, doily. This one opens that way. Got the little pocket here. We got um, dragonfly postcard in there. It's all been stenciled. So you can write on here, on here. You've got your pocket <clears throat> and you have your tag in there. And then at the top here, we have another tag, which has just been coffee dyed and stenciled. Another little uh, dragonfly ticket, crocheted trim, and a bead dangle. A little flip there, paper bag, doily, and a little corner pocket here, which um, I made that from one of the pages that I cut down. Another journal card, and another tag. So that is the journal, and I love all that collaging 
it's fabulous so there we have it another journal um love and really like blue at the moment um i like little journals and traveler's notebooks and blue <laughs> that's what i like um <clears throat> so there we have it uh like i said this will be listed in my shop if you're interested if you have any questions about the journal then please ask and um thanks for watching bye